away. No way. Well, I got uh, a request uh, the other day, well, two or three days ago now, from his son-in-law who doesn't really ask me any for anything really. He doesn't. Uh, he's quite a nice lad, but uh, he's not over talkative. And uh, he, he brought me some paper in, and uh, it's it, this is the paper you're looking at now on the screen, and it's it's called toasted. Toasted, that's the name of it, and it's a contemporary design and an illustration um, uh, in vinyl and it's um, by Aurelia Lange, I think that's her name, Aurelia, A-U-R-E-L-I-A-L-A-N-G-E -E. and the paper is produced by Urban Graphics off the web, I don't know if anybody's interested, but uh, um, and he wanted it to cover, he wanted it to cover his book that I'd made and this, even the book produced a challenge for me because the book he wanted, he wanted rather a large man-sized book and um, this is it finished completed, I mean I've got a, I've got a thing out on the web of um, how I make books so I'm not going <clears> to <throat> not going to go into making books all the time it's, a, it's just what I'm doing at the moment and uh, what I'm producing now this is an A5 book <clears throat> which is half the size of A4 which is normal fool's cap and um, he wanted <clears throat> a book with lines in and then I said well I can't produce lines Dave because um, the paper won't allow it A4 paper you fold it over it becomes B6 once you fold it probably b6 is only half this size that's that's like that you can only produce books in b6 with lined paper in um unless you buy the paper on its own well he wanted rather a large book well this is over an inch thick well it's it's virtually impossible to get lined paper in inch in thick paper so uh anyway i broke the back of it and i produced it using word <clears throat> and this is what i came up with i came up with um this this kind of thing uh, with lines in on on word, and uh, I was very very pleased with myself because I'd never done it before. Now this is a bubble jet printer, and um, it it'll work, and uh, it, it it's a lot cheaper than I than buying one of these books. <laughs> if you want to buy one of these big thick heavy books, uh, this is what he wanted. I do believe this is what he wanted, and I did tell him I couldn't do it, so he doesn't know at the moment that I've made this. So I should be quite pleased to. Uh, to give him it. Yeah, just a notebook and I put a ribbon in. He didn't want a case, although <clears throat> I did um, I did sand the sides up on this one with my little sander. And uh, it's not too it's not pristine clean or sharp and it won't but it is only a dust book so I don't think he's really bothered. He just wanted a, a dust book. Anyway, and the new there's a couple of new things I've done on this. I've actually covered it in Fablon. I don't know if you can see there's a, a hell of a shine on that. And I'm hoping it's going to like that, but it, it will make the paper longer wearing. Uh, although it is a vinyl coloured paper, it won't take the bashing that office work that where he's going to use it. I presume he's going to use it in his office, or he might use it in his den. I'm, I've got no idea. His den at home. Um, so it, it is going to be a hard wearing book, this, and it's going to take some whack and it's going to get thrown around. So I've produced it the best I can. Anyway, and uh, just to prove that. Well, not to prove that I could do two. What I did was I I made another one, but I used this paper, which is um, the normal paper that you use for printing pages and things. is about eight, 75 to about 80 GSM. Well, between 70, you don't normally get 70 and 75. You normally get about 80, 75 to 80 GSM. That's grams per square sheet in weight. And that's about 43 pounds in, in, in American uh, talk and I, I bought this paper which is rather expensive and uh, the wife doesn't know how much I've paid for it but I did want it and I've seen it used on other things and it does give a, a, a rather sharp definition on on uh, lots of things and you can see through it's really readily able to see through it's it's a, a beautiful paper it's Japanese and it's this particular brand is called the Yuzen Shiogama and uh, I want well it, it, it's it's over five pound a sheet anyway 
and the sheets are about three by about four or something like that rolled up sheets and I got two of these and uh, I produced I'll just put that other way I produced this book and uh, the, the Shiogama sheets are um, they're about 40 GSM they're only half the weight of the normal paper but they are incredibly strong but they do work incredibly easily and this is no, it's exact. It's an exact copy of the book there with smaller pages in. That's all. And uh, this book I've done for myself just to just to keep a copy. Yeah, I stopped there just to answer the phone. I've turned it off now. Anyway, it was uh, somebody I didn't want to know in any case. And um, yeah, and this is a similar type type of thing, but I've put just in case somebody else wants it. It's it's built. In the same fashion and it's got a fablon back on it and everything like that and uh, I haven't done anything extra special on it or anything but it was easy to make because I'm not fumbling around now not exactly what to do and I put on it um, the notebook was made for by and etc no, no, nothing too flash but uh, the pages look decidedly better in this one because I, I haven't made any mistakes and they all came out the right way the only problem was that our me printer is becoming a bit uh, a bit awkward and I've had to change the, the cartridge halfway through and um, yeah so anyway I'm hoping that that's um, of interest to somebody it's just something new it's just something new that I'm trying uh, two different backs I got a Japanese back and the um, Aurelia Lange covering at the back there that my son-in-law picked and uh, it's just record I think they're record covers actually I think the the drawings are made I don't know the drawings are by but uh, they're, 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 um, they're depicting record covers of different groups craft work and uh, the strokes and uh, Tom Waits so I don't even know Massive Attack I don't know these people I knew Elvis Presley when I <laughs> Elvis Presley and Roy Rogers. <laughs> I don't know these people. Nick Drake, whoever he is. But uh, yeah, so I'm hoping that's of use, some use to somebody and or of some interest, and uh, it'll give you some ideas about what to do for yourself. But that Oregon, that uh, Japanese wallpaper is very, very good if you can get hold of it or you can afford it or whatever. It's it's really, really beautiful stuff, isn't it? Anyway, I'll stop there.